And welcome back. Morning's upon me, and I still have no idea what material to use here. I'm going through the inventory here, the craft book, guidebook, whatever you want to call it, trying to find good materials to use, both for the floor and for the walls. I had stumbled upon one material that I thought was really nice. Unfortunately, there was no way to make it, which I did not under- Oh, it's actually this guy right here. Stone brick. Love the texture. The only way to create it, though, is by combining materials that were made from it with the circular saw. I don't understand how that's possible. How did you get the material in the first place to put it in the circular saw? Where does it come from? How do you get it? Evidently you don't. It's a magical item that can't be made. Coal stone. Well, how do you get coal stone? You need coal and stone, you get one. Yeah, that would cost way too much. I don't have that kind of coal sitting around. Iron stone's gonna be the same. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. There's a lot of interesting materials, but you have to harvest odd stone to get them. And I honestly have no idea where you find these stone, like this stuff. No, that's not it, never mind. There's some materials that I... Interesting. Some materials that I don't know... Don't know what they're made of. Like it's some kind of stone material, but I couldn't read the name. Because I don't have a college degree. And evidently one's necessary to be able to read the word. You know, so. Like I got the slate stuff. Slate would look cool. But I'd have to find it. Someplace. Out in nature and then dig it all up. And I have not found any slate. Maybe I can find that other one here. Yeah, this... Nice? Nice? I'm assuming the G is silent. But yeah, there's all this stuff and I don't know where to find it. So I think what we're gonna do... Is just go to... The good old fallback. Moonbrick. Interesting. How does one make moon brick? Brick block and stone. Okay, well, how do you make brick block? Four pieces of clay. I would need a lot of that. Now, I do have a lot of clay. But I don't think I have that much a lot of clay. So we're just going to use the same material that we used on the tower. Which, I guess maybe I don't have as much of as I would like to have. I may not even have enough. Now, we're just going to be for the first rung around and then the outside edges, I think. We got nothing in there. Turn that puppy on. Or wait. I might have a bunch of cobble sitting around that just needs to be cooked. I should probably check that. Cobble, cobble, cobble. Yeah, I have tons of cobble. I just need to cook that stuff up. So I can probably turn the... the cobble generator back off. Don't think I need that running. Na 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 na. Sapling still hasn't grown out here. Yeah, you can turn off. All right. So exterior walls, and then where doorways are, will be stacked bricks. It'll kind of give it a look as if the brick is being structural. 
because structural things are very necessary in my test. Only if you're building the sand or gravel. Neither of which am I. That should do. Now I do have to put a doorway into this someplace. Which I have not decided where that's going to go. Front or side honestly doesn't really matter. And you know what? I'm just going to throw dirt in there because that doesn't matter either. You'll never see it. As it'll have a block on top of it. You actually won't even see half of that corner. But... I'll put it in anyway. Fill those holes. And continue on. Have that in place. Alright, so there's the hall. And... There we go with that. Out of materials. Yeah, it's going to happen a lot. But... I need more... Do I have any random leaves? No. Pine I don't think I could use for oil extract. So, and we'll just do 40 for now and keep right along. So, yeah, first level will be the stone and then some kind of wood. I would like to branch out to some other woods that I haven't used yet but that means I have to find trees which as you may remember depending on how long you've been watching not one of my strong points I spent like two episodes and got what three saplings or something which fortunately turned into enough to get me where I am now with a whole little forest over in the castle area but yeah that takes time I need to find I don't know jungle trees are kind of too big honestly they're just they take forever to harvest and I'd like to have something that uh, is kind of easy to cut down like even these pine trees Wait. There literally is a jungle tree out there. How did that get there? Seriously, how did that... Was that there before? I don't remember ever seeing a jungle... Whoops. I don't remember ever seeing a jungle tree before. Interesting. Most interesting indeed. Well, I will put these corners in. Huh, I forgot that. And there should have been one there as well. And I think that's it for the exterior. Interior, I don't think I'm going to use any brick. I'll use some kind of wood. I'll probably do a different wood for the interior than the exterior here. And I may even break this wall up into four block wide segments probably will because that will kind of give it some consistency one two three four yeah and then if we do the same here and this could be our entrance yeah and then just going all the way around. Yeah, that'll work. We'll put some windows in here. And 
someplace there'll be a receptionist area where you uh you know rent the room and everything probably along this wall right here that way there's a room there and then there's all the rooms here i think that'll work so then it needs a pathway leading to it so let's work on that um this material should probably become basalt i'm thinking because that's still their floor and then we need to meet up with the path here so let's do something like that maybe oh wow I have one slab on me okay and then a few of them need to be the full blocks whoa whoa ho ho I didn't want to do that I wanted that one and I'll do that as well and then I think the rest of those I'll do as slabs and that that should do it I may have to enlarge the width on the path a little bit and I think I'm definitely gonna want to do some kind of lighting out here because this is kind of dark and that doesn't even make sense to be there so I'll just get rid of it and in fact I'll get rid of those as well yeah this is really dark I need some more lamp posts and lamps but because I don't have any of those on me I'll just throw a couple torches out as temporary lighting it'll keep keep too many monsters from spawning hopefully alright so they have a little pathway now going to the hotel obviously it'll have doors there there'll be solid walls it'll be safe from zombies and all that bad stuff but that's gonna wrap this episode up I will off camera do a bunch of exploring and look for some trees and stuff that I can use to get some new materials to use for the walls and definitely going to check out that jungle tree. But thanks for watching. I will see you guys next time.